hello YouTube. So today is the second day of me posting whatever these are. The plan is to get a little laundry done while I mumble. After looking back at my video yesterday, I'm kind of realizing you're a little slow and kind of boring, but I think that's kind of the point of a video diary, right? Is that you just kind of see what happens and if you make something good, it's good. And if you make something bad, it's still good because it's out there. Today seems like a good day to show off my dogs or one dog specifically. This is Candy. She is, uh, yeah, she's 14 years old. She's a miniature American Eskimo, currently shaved for the warm weather. She's like the best chill homie you could have. There's nothing but sleep and real, oh, and has allergies right now. She's a good cat. I won't hold her hostage. Goodbye. Ah. Okay, what did I want to talk about today? I wanted to talk about, um, I feel like my relationship with ad customization has just gotten super, super fucked up. Or not even ads, just the thought of how I see myself based on what ends up on my feed. If you're watching TikTok or YouTube or anything, that's the, you know, omnipotent, 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 whatever that word is, godlike figure that determines what you're going to watch, right? And so, like, if I ever get, like, an Andrew Tate video, it's like, fuck, that's, I hope that's not how the internet gods see me, because that sucks. Uh, oh, in that line of thinking, if I'm watching... Uh, you know, political commentary, if I end up watching a Hassan video and I get a Daily Wire ad prior to that, like how intentional is that? Is that the Daily Wire targeting specific creators like Hassan? Or is this just like a coincidence that it's all in like the political sphere and so you get those ads? But that's kind of eerie. So that kind of bummed me out. So I just made, or I just collected footage for another, you know, cooking short yesterday. And it was using the wok or a wok to cook chicken. I don't know what it is, but like, I'm just terrified about using that thing. Like every time I use it, I've either seen a fire, burn the shit out of something. Actually, no, those are the two things, but they happen far too frequently compared to using a pan. And sure enough, yesterday, uh, I just burned garlic. And you know, it just looks depressing when you do that. So maybe that's on, Maybe that's not me, that's something I have to work on. That seems to be kind of a trend where if I get paranoid or kind of freaked out by something, it just kind of leads to a spiral of procrastination and pushing that, you know, learning curve farther away. Yeah, that that's also kind of a bummer. You know what, I said I was gonna be folding laundry for some of this. So I'll, I'll put at least one clip of me doing that. Future David, if you remember these shorts, you should buy more of them because they're golf shorts and they're comfortable and they make me look like I'm nicer than <laughs> I desperately need better workout clothes. I've had these same basketball shorts since like eighth grade of middle school. And I mean, I guess they still work fine. They're still comfortable. They're like disintegrating, but I mean, everybody has a pair of shorts like that or something. And Laura bought these. They're like uh, dryer balls, I guess. I don't know if I can, I'll zoom in or whatever, but I think they're really cute. You know, it's the little purchases that, that matter. And I mean, I guess that's it for today. I don't know if there was anything else I really, I guess the queen died today, but I don't really know how to feel about that. You know, it's like kind of sad, I guess, because it's a historical figure and she's like been a part of history for so long, but then also, Anytime somebody's been a part of history for too long, it's not always a good thing. <laughs> so, but I don't know. I can almost put my hair in a bun. I don't know how to. I have to have Laura do it. I think I, I kind of like it as a look. I want to grow out facial hair currently, but I've never grown out more than kind of like the a not good stash. I feel like I have a lot of old people clothes. You know, or not even old people, like like dad clothes. Maybe that's not a bad thing. I'm gonna keep the, the zoom in thing because 
because that's the easiest way to end these things. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Bye.